Increase, increase. You got the increase. Are you Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by Hair VV. They were kind of to send me another unit to review for you guys. I will be showing you guys how I put this unit down, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Hint, hint, I didn't use any glue, okay? But as always, before we get into the specs of this unit and what I think about it straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Yes, I do talk fast, thank you very much. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Let me let on the line I got a little friggin' mess inside Let you know that a man has gotta deal with it I don't care what they say I'm not about to pay nobody's way Cause it's all about the dog in me Like I said, this unit comes to us from Hair VV. This is the unit Raina. It comes with brown streaks and the starting and only price for this unit is $199. I don't know if I have a coupon code for this, but if I do, it'll be linked down below, okay? You already starting, Brenda. I see you, I see you. Before you give me a thumbs down for a unit that I didn't make nor price, you guys you guys know the deal, okay? Shopping your budget, but let me go ahead and tell you the specs of this unit real quick because I think it's worth every penny. Let me tell you why. This unit does come with lace from ear to ear as well as five and a half inches of parting space here in the middle. You can repart the unit, it just comes in that natural middle part. There are no combs in the front of this unit, but there is one comb in the back and the adjustable straps. It also comes with a brand new piano elastic band. So normally when you get an elastic band in the unit, it's pretty much stationary in one one part of the cap. Sometimes that elastic band is good, it's behind my ears, it's sitting straight. Other times it may be right up on my ears, irking my nerves the entire video. But this one comes with the piano option, meaning you can adjust the elastic band inside the cap. Move it to one, two, three, or the fourth slot to place the elastic band wherever you need it in the cap based on your head shape and size. You also can choose your cap size, so small, medium, or large. You guys know my head is 23 inches on a bad day, okay, gang, gang. This shoe does come with a pre-plugged hairline as well as bleach knots, and it also comes with the brand new updated invisible fake scalp. Now, if you watched my previous video with this company, it had the fake scalp in it. And I told you guys that was probably like the best wig I ever tried on my channel ever. And that fake scalp to me fit down on my head just fine. So instead of the old way where it had the two layers on the top um, to make that fake scalp for you, this one gives you a thin one layer to make the fake scalp. You also get the option to choose the color of your fake scalp. And the colors are cappuccino, mocha, and honey. So they did send me um, some samples to show you guys of what those look like. Love their packaging. It's like a, you know, a matte black type of thing with a little ribbon around it. They're real bougie, okay, but I'm here for it. In the packaging, you also get some little hair clips and you get an extra rat tail comb. You can never go wrong with too many rat tail combs. Thank you. Also get another edge brush. I got like so many of these daggone things, but I thank you. I so, I so appreciate it, okay? They sent me the cappuccino and the mocha color. So let me show you guys what the old ones look like. So initially, they would put these little, um, um, stocking caps, you know, the wig caps we wear in our hair. So they would use these to put into the cap. So this one is the regular dark brown cap. That is how they will make that fake scalp, by using this stocking cap. They also sent me the light brown color. Okay, so you can see the difference between those two. And I usually wear these two colors under my wigs anyway. So this is what it looked like under your cap initially when they did the um, fake scalp method. Now they have the updated invisible scalps. Let me get it open, come on, let's get it. Come on, come on, I can't. <laughs> I'm gonna get in here one way or another, okay? Open sesame, dang. Okay, now this is the new invisible scalp. Oh, that feel nice, that feel real nice, okay? It's very, very thin, it's very soft. Now this is the mocha color, okay? This is what that color looks like on my hand. That does look a little bit darker for me, and that is what the cappuccino looks like on me. Yeah, that looks a little bit better. It's a little bit lighter, but I can definitely blend it down a lot better with my skin tone. So you basically choose the color you want based on you know your complexion. So I'm here for that, thank you for giving us options okay we love options out here it also says that it doesn't 
have that line of demarcation anymore. Wait, what's in my eye? What's in my eye? I honestly do not remember my previous unit having a line of demarcation at all because I had the twist in my unit, so I don't think I could really see it. Now with this one, I can definitely see that lighter cap right there, but you know, it's it's workable, okay? If I would've went in with you know some more powder or whatever and did that, it would've been just fine. I didn't wanna do that because I wanted to show you guys right off the pack what it looked like. Even though I have the cappuccino color, which blends down pretty much really good to my skin tone, I would still have to go in just a teeny bit to darken this up to make this um, blend more seamlessly. Because as you can see right here, this is the front of the cap and they bleached these knots to perfection. That lace looks bomb, okay? It's just the lace into that invisible cap that gives me the, you know, that line of demarcation. Now for me, I understand the method to the madness as far as, you know, putting the caps into the unit so you don't have to wear your own cap or whatever. But I still have my own cap on because I like to have my hair protected under this unit. I don't like the inside of wigs touching my actual hair. I still have to have my hair covered. So I never not wear my wig cap under my unit regardless. The wig grip and that piano elastic band is giving me life. It's holding this joint in place. I did not glue anything down on this unit. No glue, no glue. I use a little bit of my edge booster to do a little slick them down across the front and that is about it. Now instead of spraying the hair down on this side because they were a little flappy in the wind, I decided to go ahead and just fold them joints up, you know, above my ears and I just did a little swoopy action and there we go with that. So as far as I'm concerned, like I said, this unit is worth your coin because of everything that you get with this unit. This is a perfect unit for beginners who do not want to do a lot of work with that unit, especially when it comes to plucking and bleaching. Not all hairlines are created equal, okay? You you know that, you've seen my channel, okay? Some hairlines need a little bit of work, especially when they're in that cheaper price point. So ask and you shall receive that price increase, okay? Increase, increase, you got the increase. <laughs> It may not be the increase you were expecting, but it's an increase. So that price point is hitting where this wig is sitting. What's going on? I can't have my wig slipping back. I did go in for a little bit of my dry shampoo. I got this travel size one from Walmart. So, you know, if you need some dry shampoo, you can get it from Walmart. They also have it at the dollar store. So, you know, but I use a little bit in my unit to kind of, you know, liven it up here because I did not want to use any hairspray. It's giving me the messy look that I want. This is what I wanted. Okay, if you don't like it, keep it straight. It's, use your flat iron, okay? Get to bumping. The hair texture is really soft. It gives off like that silky type of texture. It does hold a curl really, really well. As you saw in the put down, the unit comes pretty much out the box, ready to wear. Um, it comes in like a sleek, you know, straight bob style. But you guys know, I don't really like sleek on me all the time. And I really want to give this unit some life because it does not have any layers in it. It's one sleek length all the way around. 10 inches all the way around, okay? All the way around. I'm loving the color of this unit, y'all. It looks so, so good. They did the highlights justice. Y'all see, look, y'all see that? Do you see it, Gerald? I have no serious complaints about this unit. The only thing that I could say, you know, if I'm nitpicking, is that little line right there. That, that's the only thing that I could say could potentially make anyone be like, mm, I'm not getting that. <laughs> But as far as I'm concerned, this looks good on me. But that is all I got for you guys today. I will put the direct link as well as my specs for this unit down below. Now, if there is a coupon code for this one, I will put it down below, so make sure you guys use that. Shout out one more time to Hair VV for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also, smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.